How to be a real man, let's go. Men. What yes. are they? For centuries, us women not sure. have tried to figure them out. Such strange, fascinating creatures. But recently, strange, men have creatures. been in a crisis. <laughs> Sperm count is low. Liberalism oh, no. is high. Testosterone oh, no. is decreasing. Testosterone Soy is increasing. The Ooh. femboy population ah. is skyrocketing. Hell Instead yeah. of chopping wood and hunting mammoths, men are throwing on thigh-high socks and cat ears. The question on everyone's good, mind right? is, how do we stop this epidemic? How do we save men? <laughs> I want to be a real man. Well, today we're finally going to get answers because I looked for them in the most knowledgeable, reliable, and trustworthy place on earth, Reddit? the internet. What oh, is the internet. a man? A man is somebody who kills the bugs, opens the jars, and dies in the wars. That is a man. Open the jars? Some people yes. will say the correct way to be a man is to be protective and strong and blah 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 blah. Others, however, will say being a man is about drinking your coffee black and not playing video games. What? I like, I like my coffee black. I can open jars. Does that mean I'm a man? Grown men should not be playing video games past the age of 12. Video games are for children. Men who say they want a gamer video girlfriend are, are gay. If you want a girlfriend oh. who plays video games, just date a man. Fellas, is it gay? What? If you want a GF who plays video games, just date a man. Women should not be playing video games. What? Really? Also, you're not supposed to play video games after the age of 12? Oh. Well. <laughs> I didn't start playing video games a lot until I was a working adult, so I don't know what to tell you. And most of the time, I, I couldn't play video games before because I don't have money to buy them. What the hell? I didn't even have a computer before. If it's gay, then I am gay. <laughs> oh no. Gamer girlfriend. If you want a gamer girlfriend, you're gay. Okay, all right. Just date a man. Fellas, is it gay to want a girlfriend who shares interests with you? Men will spend uh, six apparently. hours a day playing Call of Duty instead of signing up to join the real army and serve their country. I would serve myself rat poison before I serve this country. If you're a man oh, dating no. a woman who plays video games, <laughs> you probably real. get pegged by her too. <laughs> I'm sure some of them like that. <laughs> Oh my! <laughs> if you if you a man dating woman who plays video games, you probably get picked by her. Oh wow, that's too that's too harsh. I mean, I don't know. It's gay to be happy. Be a man. <sighs> be a man, dude. I wasn't aware that girlfriend. Share the same passion as me is gay, then I am gay. Yeah, that's the thing. You're not supposed to share interest with your special someone. You're supposed to be different. You're supposed to be opening jars. She's supposed to be asking you to open the jars. Yes. Dude, have you ever tried to open a really tight kimchi jar? <laughs> I always struggle with that. Because I like buying kimchi. And they, they are packaged in jars, right? And they're so tightly sealed. So what I usually do is I boil water and then pour, and then pour water on the lid. And then pour the hot water in the lid and then pour like um, cold water on it after so I could touch it. And then try to open it. You know when that happens? When I open a really tight kimchi jar, the kimchi flows to the top. It's like it overflows. So you got a stinky hand, you got a counter full of kimchi, and everywhere is kimchi because it just explodes. It's not really explode. It's like it explodes slowly, the kimchi. But I still love it. That's what usually happens when I open a kimchi jar. By the way, I can open my own jars. I have a technique. Mm. Dislocating the shoulder to open a jar. <laughs> no, 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 no. I use hot water. Or sometimes I like... I stick the end of the knife on the side of the lid and like poof, you, you, you gotta pop it a little bit and you can open it easily. It's very dangerous though. I'm always nervous when I do that. Like when you, when you use a knife to like scooch over the lid of the jar. Mm. 
Yeah. Anyway, that's the technique, guys. If you're having difficulty opening jars, pour hot water on the lid or use a knife. My technique involves a hammer. <laughs> oh, no. Don't wipe, be a man. Yeah. Wash your ass, but don't wipe. <laughs> I'm sure some of them like that. Grown ass men that play video games, ask yourself this When's the last time you've been laid? It is so cool how, like, technology has just improved so much. Like, it is really cool how we can see tweets made in 1998. Men who collect really? things creep me <laughs> out. Like, what do you need shit. 300 Pokemon cards for? Okay, so first of all, 300 Pokemon cards is not that many Pokemon cards. Yeah, I think I have more than 300 Pokemon cards. And I organize them a lot for a from cutest to ugliest. Say, well, how many shoes do you think cutest this woman <laughs> <laughs> What's with the sudden trend of grown men playing with children's toys? Do these men also make spaceshipy sounds when playing with them? Hashtag manchild. I Do you make the vroom vroom sounds when you play with your cars? With your small cars? Not not the big cars, okay? Just the, the little uh, tiny cars. Do you make sound effects when you play with your action figures? Vroom vroom whoosh! The fuck am I supposed to do, right? When you're playing with toys, you're supposed to make those sounds. How else uh, are you gonna know that your uh, your fantasies are real if you don't make the whoosh whoosh sounds? These people on Twitter are so weird. I'm a man, that is why I always struggle with the jar until I either open it or they try it. <laughs> oh no. You need a better technique for opening the jar. You can't see it because it's censored, but they added Lauren Chen here. We'll like, sound is this attractive? Noises, yeah, <laughs> mommy, yeah. is this attractive? Mommy, Bro sorry, mommy. Also, Bro building Bro models. I feel like that's a very normal male hobby to have. No hobby is masculine or feminine, but if we are doing this shit, I think building things is pretty masculine. Like, is society in general not just men building, building things? things. <laughs> then someone asked this guy a valid question. Question. Please provide your list of acceptable leisure activities Ooh, that meet your approval. And this is what Let's this go. dude said. Changing the oil in the car, mm -hmm. upgrading the RAM in the family computer, mm -hmm. doing the laundry, reading, writing, making chili or soup, home repair, Ooh, playing soccer slash rugby slash football slash hockey. Most of these are just chores. Oh boy, can't wait to change the oil in the car. Updating RAM <laughs> on the family computer. That's his hobby. Oh god, I remember having a family computer. I remember not knowing how to delete the history off the family computer. Oh, Nothing no. more soy than grown men obsessed with a sports team. Men with a favorite sports team are highly sports unattractive team. to me. A man is supposed to dominate his field, what? conquer resources. Wait, I thought it's part of being a man to be a fan of a sports team. I don't get it. It's so strange. I thought that was part of the stereotype. ...ravage his opponents and bring glory to his name and family, and here he is, watching and cheering on other men doing just that. A masculine cuckery. <laughs> calling masculine people cuckery. men oh, no. who watch dudes in tights chase a ball around a field covered in woke messaging while our country goes up in flames might be a stretch. Your country is being invaded and destroyed and you're watching sports ball? Sad. Like, what do these guys do all day for fun? The only ex- Yes? Why are you meowing, sir? What is soy? Yeah, it's a bean. But why do they call people soy? Slang? Vegans, social liberals, and other groups. Also been used in online debates about the fashion appeal of cargo shorts. Huh? Cargo shorts? Cargo shorts is soy? Having a feminist and an- Athletic look and an alleged smile called the soy face. Soylent Green, which is a pun on the 1973 dystopian film by Soylent Green. Cargo shorts is soy? But my father wears cargo shorts. He's very masculine. I don't understand. People are weird on the internet. Pockets and more pockets. How is that soy? I don't know. I love pockets. I like big pockets. People seen as snowflakes or as weak and feminine. Soy boy. Weak and feminine. Mmm. Because soy is vegan. Is that why? And you're supposed to be a carnivore. Supposed to be eating meat all the time. But, like, when you say it out loud that you like meat, imagine, okay. Imagine, as a person, if you're shouting out loud that you like meat. I like meat! Or you like soy. Someone screaming that they like meat or they like soy. Which one sounds more 
kind of suspicious. Isn't it kind of suspicious if you hear someone screaming that they love meat? Because meat also has a different connotation. You know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean? Right? I don't know. I'm just questioning these words. I was very suspicious about these words. Um, I love meat. <laughs> yeah, meat. I love meat. Oh my god. No vegetables for me. Meat. Only meat. It's a jo joke that drinking soy makes you. Oh, if you drink soy. God, I don't like soy though. Soya, soya milk. I don't like soy milk. It's disgusting. I don't like it because of the taste, but I like um, chocolate soy milk. If there is a soy milk that's flavored chocolate, it's really good. But just the normal soy milk or it's like banana flavor? Oh, God, gross. Gross. A snake is a very funny creature. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's just, a, it's just a long noodle. Is that a dancing snake or are you happy to see us? It's both. It's both dancing and it's both happy to see you. The snake. Acceptable manly activity to some of these people is like making fun of 15 year olds on TikTok who are experimenting with their gender identity. <laughs> I feel like it's really not that deep. Like we've always been a very competitive species. We used to watch people species. fight in like coliseums. We used to watch men get ripped apart by lions in coliseums. Now we watch stickball or we watch two nerds debate I mean, about politics on Twitch. Right? That is our Olympics. modern day coliseum. UK builders go woke. Study finds three quarters of tradesmen discuss their feelings with colleagues oh, while two-thirds their, their oh, fried no. breakfasts and nearly half say they are history buffs. What the fuck does going woke mean anymore? <laughs> Fellas, is it woke to have friends and like history? <laughs> no airbags, woke, we die like, like real men. <laughs> oh. <laughs> went on oh, a date my. with a man who got in our Uber and instantly put on a seat belt. The date what? went okay and he was sweet, but I ghosted him. I How could not dare? get the image of him wearing a seatbelt out of my mind. Feminine. If you're How a grown you man wear a seatbelt wear seat belt in the passenger seat, you are likely to be a raging homosexual. Dude, look at that profile picture, though. You know he's a real man because he he's got his titties out like that. You know how you spot a real man on Twitter if they got their titties out in public in a public profile. <laughs> Brother cargo shorts are basically the most manly thing a gun can wear. A guy can wear. Zero fashionability, all utility. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can put all your tools in the pockets. Mm. Safety is gay. Be a man. You gotta wear your seat belts. Come on. Come on. You know what? I feel like if someone has their profile picture that where they're nude or topless, I'm kind of more suspicious of them than when they're just wearing like normal clothes or maybe it's like a it's, it's like a porn account or something who knows we don't know because the name is uh, it's not here do you follow people or do you have friends on facebook with um, profile pictures that are nude or topless what do you think about that Oh, you know what? Or maybe they're they're proud of their gains. Actually, maybe I'm being judgmental here. Because there's people who are getting into the gym lately and they are very proud of their gains, so they like posting their topless pictures. You know what? I'm sorry for judging you, topless man. But that's a weird tweet nonetheless. <laughs> Cargo shorts plus socks and sandals. Oh yeah, it's Tito vibes. <laughs> Do you wear those so are you do you have the Tito vibes? <laughs> mm, what about motorcycles? They have no seat belt. Oh, you're right. What about motorcycles? Can you put a, a seat belt on a motorcycle? You know what? Maybe that's the manliest thing ever. If you ride the motorcycle, that's one point to your manliness. Are bikers gay? No, they can never be gay because they're not wearing seat belts. Even though women, they're also men. Because they're not wearing seatbelts, according to this tweet. I don't know. <laughs> Fellas, is it gay to not want to die in a car accident? Speaking of seatbelts, I actually found out recently that when seatbelts were first invented, there was like this whole anti-seatbelt movement of people that were just like, belt. I will Ooh. not wear my seatbelt. The government can't force me to wear a seatbelt. And when I pointed this out online, like 50 of my own fans were like, shoo, this would have been you. And like... 
Mm. Fair enough. The sudden trend of men being attracted to female asses is part of the homosexual agenda. What? Men and it's women have asses. Like, if they can get you what? attracted to asses, what's stopping you from being attracted to a man's what? ass? No way. If a man prefers tits over ass, I just assume he is gay or at least bisexual. What? If you also like boobies, you're gay? If you like ass, you're gay. If you like boobies, you're gay. Which are you supposed to like? Nothing? You're not supposed to like any body part of it, I guess. So weird. Sister Midnight, thank you for the raid. I appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. It's me, Naganyum. How you knew me? <laughs> you just arrived at the right time. <laughs> Perfect timing. <laughs> I can't believe it's gay to like, but I don't understand it. Is it gay to like butt? Is it gay to like boobies? Hello! Welcome, welcome. All Brazilians are gay then? Butts are the goal here. Uh, feet then. Feet? Mm. Hello, Steb. Welcome, welcome. It's me, Naganyum. I Nyum play games. I uh, talk about uh, pooping. Once, once per stream. What else do I do? Um, I react to things on YouTube because it's fun. Hey, hey, hello. Thank you for the burger. We're watching Show on Head right now. How to be a real man. Yes. Did you have fun? Hope you had a wonderful stream. What were you playing? By the way, if you have to take a rest and uh, eat or go sleep, feel free to do so. Thank you for the support. Men have butts too, so it's gay. <laughs> I like big butts when I cannot lie. It says here, if you like tits over ass, either gay or bisexual. Mm -hmm. Game to make brain go brr. What would that game be? Mm. Real men prefer ass over tits. Once what? a man has reached puberty, he Which should find the breasts of a woman repulsive. They are meant <laughs> to feed babies. You are no longer a baby. Grow up. Oh, no. Can't like a woman's no ass. Movies. Can't like a woman's tits. You're gay no matter what. All roads lead to gay. Restaurants? Soy. <laughs> Bars? <laughs> soy. Everything people do to have fun is based around soy. Nature? Chad. Buying oh, big ass steaks and nature. eating them raw in the park? Chad, I would ah, call the cops on you if I saw raw, that. Yes, meat. hello, there is a strange man eating what? raw meat Sorry. in the park yeah. around my children. Fine. Men that don't wear dresses or drink from straws. What? You Watching YouTube videos straw? is a You're female mad. trait. Men who watch YouTube might as well be women. Well, there you go. <laughs> YouTube. <laughs> My YouTube, my YouTube analytics says my viewers are 98% male, <laughs> but it says here, if you watch YouTube videos, you're, uh, you're not a man. So there you go. Everyone has been transformed into a woman now. <laughs> my God. You can't watch YouTube videos if you're a real man. Okay. I eat my meat while it's still moving. <laughs> You go to the left. Ooh, that sounds fun. Hell yeah. Back in my day, it's enough as long as it's a woman. Mm. You can't watch a YouTube video if you're a real man. You're a woman now. I have one friend that used to be a girl and is a man now. Showed me this operations card. Did not find the chest attractive anymore, unfortunately. This proves I am not gay. I think. Hmm. Maybe. Not sure. <laughs> Pink Devil is not sure about it. Or maybe you just... You just consider your friend a friend, you know? You're just not romantically interested in them or like sexually interested in them. That's how it is. Sometimes there's people you just consider as friends. It's not about the size of the boobies. It's about who it is attached to. Okay? It's not about the boobies. It's about the person that the boobies are attached to. There you go. Lesson learned from Managanium channel. You're welcome. A real man watches TikTok. Well, 
put on the dress. Men should dress like men and women should dress like women. Culture is clearly trying to blur these lines and Christians should exemplify the Christians. distinctions. <laughs> Ladies, wear dresses often, keep Why? your hair long and stay healthy. Why? Men, ditch the gay look, grow a beard, and get strong. Ah yes, nothing gay men hate more than strong men with beards. Men who grow mm, beards are insecure and want to feel beards. more masculine because inside they don't feel masculine. Men need what? to come to grips with the fact that we've all committed sexual assault on women. Oh no. Uh, men in the what comment the section, uh, comment if you've you've never committed a sexual assault on a woman. Like this video if you've never That's committed extreme, sexual good. assault on a woman. Subscribe to this channel if you've <laughs> never committed sexual assault on a woman. No grown man oh should God. be drinking margaritas. Men drinking cocktails, it's not big and cocktails. it's not clever. It makes ye look like an absolute tit. And birds drinking pints makes ye look like a lorry driver. What is a lorry? This is the most British shit I've ever heard in my life. What is a lorry? Oh, a truck! Makes you look like a truck driver? What's wrong with being a truck driver? What the hell? What's wrong with being a truck driver? Don't get it! Don't grow a beard because I look like a... what? Look like a Shaolin Grandmaster. Them catfish whiskers. <laughs> oh no. Hello, Pyramid. Misogyny is funny? No, it's not. My dad is a truck driver. If mm. I need a translator. Something that gives me the ick is men drinking hot drinks. Grown men shouldn't be hot getting drinks? nothing from You're the not ice supposed cream to truck. Drink hot I drinks. still get excited oh, no. when I hear the ice cream truck. Also, I just need to know, what are y'all choosing? I'm going with the Spongebob one. Every time. If you are a male and fudge go to pop. any I like restaurant- the, I like the fudge pop. This one looks good. I didn't know it's called a fudge pop. Coleslaw? There's coleslaw in the ice cream truck? No way. Tony Soprano bar. Orbeez. Oh, we don't have Orbeez. Bored. <laughs> Chili. Tylenol. Wow. Tylenol con. Ice cream that looks like Dick Cheney's forehead. I really don't... I remember... Okay, I seem to remember someone mentioned Dick Cheney, but I don't know who Dick Cheney is. This is probably uh, a foreign thing. I don't know who this person is. Febreze. Freeze. I don't know what that is. Vanilla Isis Vanilla Ice. Long cake. Ooh, long cake. That sounds good. Nailsicle. Oh, wow, Fudge Pop. Fudge Pop looks good. Oh, Pokemon Diamond. <laughs> they could get Pokemon Diamond in Ice Cream Truck. I didn't know that. All right. America is weird. I'm going with the SpongeBob one. Every time. If you are a male and go to any restaurant and ask for a milkshake, you are gay. Real men do not drink coffee, especially not iced coffee or flavored coffee. That, that is sus. sus. If I see oh, a no. gentleman drinking tea, I assume he is a homosexual. To be honest, oh, I've no said it before, for tea is gay coffee. Men who drink- What? But English people like tea. <laughs> Juice suspected- <laughs> You're not even supposed to drink juice. Oh no. Juice, suspect as hell. I go to Starbucks solely to see the embarrassment on the eyes of the grown man who orders a low-fat iced latte frap frou-frou blah blah when he looks up and sees me taking a sip of my straight black coffee with no cream or sugar. Wow. And then everyone so on the train clapped, looks up at you and sees you. <laughs> this is the start of some like... <laughs> Yaoi fan fiction or something. Yeah, Beta males fiction. go to hipster coffee shops for a dirty chai soy latte while alpha males go to Hooters and drink beer and watch hockey. The beta male left Hooters. can attack me all they yeah, want. I will right. never I apologize understand. for being an alpha male who eats at Hooters. Going to Hooters is a gender <laughs> affirming experience. If you go to Hooters, you're Do men man. eat raspberries? Men? Do you eat raspberries? A no man. <laughs> A no man, a no real man about to sit around and eat a feminine ass food like hummus. hummus? I love how so much of this just like has to do I with food and drinks. Well. Just made up arbitrary rules about what is and what is not masculine food. Like are boneless chicken wings masculine food? Better question, mm, are boneless chicken wings, chicken wings 
chicken nuggets. Leftist men are not Ooh. real men. Leftist males are a bunch of beta losers. The reason why I say males is because I would not consider a leftist male a man. Leftist males are not real men. Simple. Mm. I don't know, like Joseph Porters. Stalin was pretty manly. Porters is an American like version of find one example of like a masculine leftist man. <laughs> I, I have to like that take again. out of the history book and- Holy <laughs> shit. Uh, uh. This shit is so dumb though, like this- American made cafe hooters. <laughs> I have seen art of like hooters. Well, like some people draw their OCs in like hooters outfit. I know what a hooters is. It's just funny. <laughs> it's like an American version of made cafe. Holy shit. Paste of aubergine from Greece. Isn't aubergine eggplant? Aubergine. Yeah, it is an eggplant. Eggplant paste. Mmm. Idea that all conservative men are like hyper masculine and like no leftist men are masculine. Like it doesn't hold up. Obviously, there are masculine leftist men. Liberal men. However, men are capitalists. Feminine men are socialists. Oh. The two genders. In reality, conservative men are the most effeminate men when you really think about it. I mean, authoritarianism in general is kind of subby. Oh, you want the state Sub to control you? You want to lick the boot? <laughs> Bottom behavior. Leftism lick lowers your testosterone. Lick the boot? Racism increases your testosterone. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> the two Not... political parties, Ooh. leftism and racism. That's so extreme. Any man it? whose heart is melted by a woman is no man at all. Fellas, is it gay woman. to fall in love? Eating girls yes, out is submissive. Apparently. You are what you eat. If you as a man eat pussy, <laughs> you are one. Licking coochie oh, is no. worse than cocaine oh, no. addiction. <laughs> eating pussy is so childish. Addiction. Eating pussy is too submissive for me. It feels gay. Literally, Aww. fellas, it's is gay. it gay to that. eat pussy? Real men eat ass. A oh. real man does not. Eat ass. Oh. Getting mixed messages here. Face Not sitting sure cowgirl in any other position with a woman on top are fundamentally acts of homosexuality. Fellas, is oh. it homosexual to have heterosexual sex? A penis has muscle tissue. The more you use it, the stronger and bigger <laughs> it becomes. The vagina is elastic. If you overuse it, it will lose its elasticity and become a borehole. A this is muscle tissue. The more you use it, the stronger and bigger it becomes. <laughs> Getting big gains that. at the gym. Don't oh, skip I got, day, get the day, bro. So this isn't even true. This is the truth. Ladies, if he's had more than three sexual... Oh! A virgin. It's still large and healthy. Hasn't been crushed inside of this. <laughs> Gooch. And will one day make the right woman a very happy wife. Oh! Alright. This is a noodle. Pee-pee of a man who has had multiple uh, sexual partners. A noodle! <gasps> oh my god. Y your pee-pee is gonna become a noodle. Pee-pee has shriveled down to less than one third of its original size due to the vaginal pressure and will no longer be able to pleasure any woman. Oh! I didn't know that happens. Your, your pee-pee becomes long and uh, noodly when you do it too much. Mm. <laughs> Can confirm. <laughs> if I eat a man, then what am I now? <laughs> I don't know anymore. Oh, yeah, yeah. Overcook. Lasog lasog noodle checks out. Oh my god. <laughs> Partners. He got a string bean. A man having the string TikTok bean? app is one thing, but making TikToks? What the actual hell is that? You know what? I actually agree with this one. F TikTok. And I'm not just saying that because I do not understand TikTok and I don't know how to navigate it or use it. Or Men with yeah, long same. hair are not men. TikTok. If I bend you over and you look like a woman from behind, you are not a man or you are gay. Wait a minute. What? So if you bend a man over, they are gay. <laughs> if you are depressed as a man, you have failed as a man. This is why so many depressed men are choosing to become women. Think hell? about why you never see emo boys anymore. Emo because boys. they're all trans women. <laughs> trans agenda really? has stolen our emo boys. If you are emo a man over are 30 real? and you have time to maintain more than five friendships, I mean real friendships, you are either a loser, groomer, or wow. gay. Fellas, is it anymore. gay to have friends? Smiling too much. 
Badge is beta, yeah, and so women know that men who smile frequently signal to other men that they are not a threat. Better smile less or smirk without showing teeth, as this is more alpha. Mm. Smirk without showing teeth? Smirk what, do you like the DreamWorks teeth. smirk? <laughs> if you are above the age of 27 and not making six figures a year, you should be forced to transition into a woman because it is over for you. The Sheesh. forced feminization of working class men. Joe Biden's America. Large pieces are seen as desirable is just another symptom of Western <laughs> degeneration. degeneration. Large pieces are a sign of low intelligence oh. and savage genetics. Small pieces <laughs> indicate high <laughs> intelligence and there aristocratic blood. Well, there you go. Large pee, -pee low intelligence. Small pee, pee high intelligence. And uh, nobility, aristocratic blood. Mm -hmm. I'm so confused by all these tweets. They're like contradicting each other. It's Jover. Turns out I'm a genius. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. Remember, man, no matter what happens, you will always end up gay. Yeah, there is no escape from gay. You will be gay no matter what. If you have a PP, you gay. <laughs> I don't understand anything. Whatever makes you feel better, bro. <laughs> Whoa equals masculine. Whoa. Wow equals feminine. Wow. Racist white dude. But Owen Wilson always says wow, though. Hmm. Wow. Wow. Stop the rush. Wait, I am gay because I have PP? Yes. If you have PP, you gay. If you like butt, who here likes butt? You gay. If you like boobies, who here likes boobies? You're also gay. If you have friends, more than five friends, you're also gay. Is it gay to have money? You're lit literally collecting pictures of men. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. That's too real. You are collecting pictures of men. Wait, is there a Filipino currency with the woman picture in it? I think there is. Um, uh, maybe 500? This one has a couple. Well, the old one only has a man picture. About 100. Does 100 have Korea Kino? Yeah, 500 does Korea. Gloria is there in 100? Well, yeah, I was thinking that Gloria would be in the 100 pesos. She's not. She's not. Where is she? Or is it the old one? Isn't there like a, a bill where there's a lot of them in the bill? Yeah, yeah. The 1000, there's three of them. Looking at monies, yeah, because uh, Jimbo said you, when you collect money, you're just collecting pictures of men. It'd be like, here's my top 25 films. These are like very normal, good movies. <laughs> These are very like popular, critically acclaimed movies. The Matrix? Racist white dudes? Don't like Glorious racist? Bastards? The movie Fight where they Club. kill Nazis? Huh. That one? Also, women have no f***ing room to talk. Don't go around calling Pulp Fiction and Fight Club red flag what? movies when your ass is binge is watching flag? serial killer documentaries. Men, it is effeminate and weak to ask a woman on a date. A real man does not ask, he takes what is right. <laughs> Rightfully his. That's uh, so toxic. No, don't, no, don't do that. No. <coughs> Ancient men me. sent to war on behalf of the empire at age 15. Leaned, jacked, sunned balls. Modern men <laughs> beg balls. for women's appreciation. Pale, depressed, fat. Ask for permission before... <laughs> A real man just pisses everywhere while making eye contact. Jacked body, calm mind. Ooh, sunned sun ball. balls. It's important to have sun balls, huh? Strong family, confident mindset, sharp and- I feel like if you find this attractive, you are pretty much uh, gay, but don't want the stigma that though. goes along with it. The muscle waifu psyop is real. They got you thirsting for women with what? male bodies. But muscle they want waifu to turn you good. gay. Like you muscle mean? mommies or strong women is gay. Fellas, is it gay to like hot women? If you like pick A over pick B, you are in fact socially engineered or slightly homosexual. Okay, hot take, but- both? Both are good. Hi, progressive leftists. Why not both? Hi. If your idea of a man is sitting around in your skinny jeans, sipping on a grande peppermint mocha made with soy peppermint topped mocha. off with whip, mm. then you do you. I'm going to do with me, soy? which is a God-fearing American who loves his country and flag. <laughs> <laughs> okay? Why is it always coffee? Why is it always Starbucks latte? I haven't brushed my teeth in over a week. I rarely brush my teeth. 
feels gay. <laughs> Ladies, what? if you want to find out if your man is gay, check the back of his toilet seat. If that shit ain't dirty, he is bisexual at least. If you wipe your ass with baby wipes and you're not a girl, <laughs> you are borderline bisexual. Please follow the wipe your ass with the baby Clean wipes. your ass. It is not manly <laughs> to have a shitty poopy asshole. <laughs> Wash your ass. Red flags list just dropped. Let's discuss. Oh, no. Sagittarius or Aquarius? Wait, no. Whoa, dude, why are people obsessed with not wiping their ass? Why is it connected to being manly? That's disgusting. Don't have a crusty butt, okay? Stop it. Get some help. Get some wipes, please. Oh my god. I cannot believe. What's this? Red flags. Oh, let's go. There's a red flag here. Sagittarius or Aquarius? That's a red flag. Follows bar stool. What, what does that mean? Follows bar stool. I don't understand what that means. Plays golf. Huh. Drinks EPAS. I don't know what EPAS is. Has Twitter. <laughs> if you have Twitter, it's also a red flag. I mean, kinda. I guess so. Twitter is a shithole, so yeah. Get out while you can. Plays Call of Duty. <gasps> it's bad to play Call of Duty as well. Doesn't like cats. Well, yes. Kinda. If you don't like cats, why not? They're so cute. Thinks Kanye is a genius. Listens to Drake. I'm not a Republican, I'm a Libertarian. Addicted to gambling, sports betting. Uh oh, no gamba allowed. Calls his ex crazy. Loves Bitcoin crypto. I mean, yeah, that's a, that's a red flag, right? I, I agree with this one. The Bitcoin crypto thing. Hates on Taylor Swift. <gasps> oh, you're not allowed to hate on Taylor Swift. Is from New Jersey. <laughs> so specific. Why New Jersey? Hello, Koala. Has abs. What? It's a red flag to have abs? I didn't know. Gonna sleep? Okay, good night, Steve. Thanks for dropping by, dude. Hello, Witkin. Likes every Instagram model's pictures. Workaholic slash likes to work hard. What? It's a red flag to work hard now? Jesus Christ. Has Snapchat streaks. What the fuck does that mean? I don't know. Obsessed with Quentin Tarantino movies. Bro, I love Quentin Tarantino movies. Um, do I have red flags? Because I love Quentin Tarantino? No way. Only has one pillow. Okay, this one? I understand. I don't understand how someone could sleep with only one pillow. How do you sleep with just one pillow on your head? How about the one that you hug? How about the one that protects you from the demons? You need at least three pillows when you sleep. Okay? Red flag has one pillow. I, I agree with this one. You need to have at least two or three pillows. Okay? Also, the thing about having one pillow. What if... What if somebody comes over? You're not gonna have... You, you're not gonna have an extra pillow to offer them. If someone sleeps over your house... They won't have a pillow. So, therefore, you need at least two pillows at home. Hmm? Okay? Loves Tom Brady. Who the fuck is Tom Brady? Wait, is Tom Brady Venom? Tom Brady. I don't know who this is. Oh, it's not Venom. He's a... Uh, football. Quarterback. I don't know who Tom Brady is. Thinks being tall is a personality trait. <laughs> I mean, it is a red flag. If you think it's a personality trait to be tall, it's so weird. Doesn't pay for your Uber to from his place. Oh. Doesn't pay for Uber. Don't you have your own money to pay for your Uber? What the hell? So weird. If you breathe, you red flag. <laughs> I'm a red flag for being alive. <laughs> Uh, is it gay to be it's gay to be alive because you're choosing to live in a world where peepees exist? Oh no. We slightly know who that is. Crusty booty establishing dominance. <laughs> no! No crusty booty. Wipe your ass. Wipe your ass, dude. Come on. Tarantino belongs in the brotherhood fit. That's true. That's true. What's this? It's uh, how to be a real man. By Sean Head. One pillow, no blankets in the winter. <laughs> yeah, that's what being a man means. Holy shit. Oh, that sounds so uncomfortable. No blankets for the winter. 
Good. Get the blanket. It's okay. You can have a blanket. Come on. Come on. Tom Hardy's Venom. Oh, Hardy. Hardy. All right. It's not Brady. It's Hardy. This one. Oh, this was what I was thinking about. Okay. Well, those are the red flags, guys. If you find this in any in any man, it did the red flag. If you watch porn of heterosexual and you see the pee, -pee does that make you gay? I don't know. I don't know. I think only you could tell if you're gay. That's what that's what my stand on it is. I don't think I mean, maybe some media could influence your sexuality, but I feel like only you, the person, can tell what you are. If you feel gay, then maybe you are. If you feel at home with that kind of sexuality, maybe you are. Who knows? But I, I, I don't think any one media could... Like, watching a certain thing or like doing a certain thing makes you gay or makes you bisexual or makes you a man or makes you a woman i don't know i feel like only you will know in your heart mm. i'm shocked nobody say it's gay to eat a banana hello there oh i remember seeing uh, a video about how to properly eat a banana if you're of nobility edward hello it's like a proper etiquette on how to eat banana with spoon and fork Wait, is that a spoon and fork or was that a knife and fork? So, so weird. <laughs> it's like so complicated. Just eat the banana, dude. <laughs> My arms will be there below. Hey, that's a good answer. <laughs> you can you can eat a banana sideways. <laughs> I cannot. The idea of someone eating banana sideways. <laughs> hey, I gotta have puppy cheeks. Do the banana. Oh no. <laughs> uh, do you eat your banana sideways? <laughs> it's so funny. Vegeta, thank you very much for the gift and sub. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> That's so funny. Knife is working, yeah, imagine. As a true man, I will now go to the store to buy milk. <laughs> oh no! Stop! <laughs> Eating a banana like a cup of corn. <laughs> so silly. It's so Apology is just racism for white women. Thinks Kanye is a genius. Well, that one aged well. Loves Bitcoin slash crypto. Okay, I actually agree with this. I had a nightmare like two years ago that I met this boy and he was really nice and then he started showing me like his little NFT monkeys on his phone. Mm. I literally had a nightmare. <laughs> it's from New Jersey. What okay. about sleeping with socks? I agree with that too. Okay. New Jersey nah, is New York's really. dump. Has abs. If you're a big fan of abs, is, uh, but I don't see how that's it's a fine. red flag. Only has one pillow. I mean, it's not a big deal if he has one pillow. It is a big deal if he has a yellow pillow. Ladies, oh! what gives you the ick when he's... Yellow pillow! Wait, are my pillows yellow? Oh no. Maybe I've been drooling on them too much, they become yellow. I mean, if your pillow... Where? What the hell? Where did it go? If your pillow is very yellow like this, you should just buy a new pillow. Oh my god, my, my previous pillow were so disgusting, I remember. Before I bought new pillows, they were really gross. It took me so long to buy new pillows. It's grosser than this. <laughs> oh, because of all the saliva and the DNA on there. Mm. And then eventually I cannot take it anymore. I mean, you don't see it. I don't see it because I put like pillow covers, right? I have pillow covers. I don't see the the disgusting yellowness, but I know it's there. And eventually, I get the I get too disgusted and I bought two new pillows. Don't worry, I don't have the yellow pillows anymore. 
I mean, they're gonna start becoming yellow because I, I drool in them. But you know, it's better than before. Mm. Why looks that pillow looks like it was making tea? <laughs> buy a new pillow. Yeah, yeah, buy a new pillow. Mine's Pasia Lloyd's brown. <laughs> no. <laughs> Take that pillow out back though. That's disgusting. Get a new pillow. Come on. Don't tell me you only oh, you only have one pillow as well. One brown pillow. Hmm. I will never replace them even though I literally have fresh shield ones in, in the closet. What the hell? Why do you love this pillow so much? Hmm. Hello? Ladies, what gives you the ick? When he's born in June. A man born June? anywhere from February 19th to March 20th does not sit right with Why? me. Why, as a man, are you born in June? There's Why? something about men being born between March and August that makes me sick, March man. Yeah. There's something very unmasculine about men who aren't born in October through December. When a man tells me his birthday is in July, I look at him sideways like, are you a girl? Why? Fellas, is it gay to be born? It really is That's racism so for women. A man has no time for happiness. <laughs> oh, no. Happiness no time for is for for women and children. I feel like according <laughs> to these people, like the rules of being a man are just like, be miserable, Barra. drink and eat only red meat and tar, mm, go to no work, red do meat. nothing do fun ever, meat, never wash your ass, and die oh, in a car gross. accident. The most masculine thing to me is honestly just like not giving a fuck. Just not giving a fuck about what other people think. Just doing and eating. <laughs> whatever you want. To me personally, it would just be a huge turnoff if a guy was like, oh no, I'm not drinking that margarita. That's a girly drink. Like, are you 12 years old? And they just have like a child's idea of Don't what think it about is to be like a grown up and on. be a man. It also just reeks of insecurity. That's like, true. why are you that afraid of looking gay? I don't get it. So that was my little fun video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please consider donating to my Patreon to help out the channel. Link down below. Oh, Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. And oh, I will see you guys my video soon. Yeah, I feel like you shouldn't care about what people on the internet think what being a man means, you know? Just uh, do what you think is righteous. Do what you think the emperor will approve. If you think the emperor will approve, that's manly. Yes. <laughs> Oh no. The only time I'll never wash my ass is if I was in prison. What the fuck? I'm sorry. Jesus Christ. <laughs> this is the ending song. Ending song. This is the ending song. <laughs>